Hey everyone, I'm Marty. This is Scrap Mechanic. Welcome back. So, what we do today in this episode? First, let's see the list I've made, which contains ideas and things I would like to construct in Scrap Mechanic in survival mode. Things that are useful and help me to survive in the game. Of course, the list is not final. I keep adding stuff, changing the order, like what to build next, right? So before we go up in the sky, as you can see, let's build something more down to earth in this episode, uh, which is wood cleaner truck. I want it to be fast, swift, and its main purpose will be to clear out the way for RCV, rock crusher vehicle, because I'm tired of cutting down trees manually, like with the hammer, and I need more and more metal, and most of the stone nodes are surrounded by trees. Okay, to build wood cleaner truck, we will need... Yes, yes, I wanted to show off. <laughs> I know, I know, it's nothing special. Driver's seat, engine, gas engine, off-road suspension, times four, bearings, wood block three, yeah, bunch of switches, controller, which I'm going to craft, component kits to upgrade the engine and the driver's seat, and maybe suspension too, probably, yes. Then we will need four wheels and three saw blades, headlights and tail lights. Okay, of course, pipes always welcome with open arms and open heart. One resource collector and gas container, aka fuel tank. Okay let's build through the night so let's start off with opening slash cleaning mechanism all right now put it uh, i don't even know how to do it oh i have an idea yes should work let's see Yep, this is exactly what I wanted, yes, <laughs> yes, yes, okay, okay, so this will be cleaner's truck bed, and it will be opening and gathering all the logs from the ground, now it's not over yet, now what we do is one, two, three, four, pipe, then pipe, uh, one, two, three, four, and pipe. I know, I know the resource collector is not in the middle. Stay with me. You'll see why in a second. Now look, then pipe, bearing, bearing, long pipe, long pipe, short short <laughs> over there and uh, t like this then one piston and short pipe and bend yes and bearing and what saw blade What happened saw blade okay now you see something is not right here I forgot to put bearings here oh my goodness okay okay this is this is nothing this is absolutely no I'm telling you it's nothing what what I said it's nothing. Now this side. I just forgot to weld it up there. Okay. 
Okay. There's no need to be worried. The construction is almost done. I will need two engines. Electric engine would be cool because it's lighter than gas engine. And I have one right here, fully upgraded. But then I would need to put in the truck battery container. So two containers, one gas, one battery. And that would be not good. So I'm kind of stuck with gas engine. So let's build one. Okay, let's place things up in the cabin. Driver's seat. One engine. Two engines. Fuel container. Large chest. Headlights. Done. Better now. engine section, driver's seat, and we'll not bother with uh, uh, roof or doors. No, it's going to be um, field style. But windshield, why not? Yeah, we are going to use armored glass. Because why not? Let's see. <laughs> well, not bad. Okay, now we got two more saw blades to install. This is cleaner truck and I think we are going to use thicker pipes this time. Actually, let's do some magic. Oh, look, it's magic. Okay, now. Bearing, bearing. Bend, bend. Then. A long, long. Bearing, bearing. Bend, bend. And what? Bearing and bearing. That sounded weird, but yeah, two bearings. Saw blade. And saw blade. You see? Cleaner truck, right? So my thinking is um, saw blades will go closer and you'll see. I I don't I don't know how to tell you this. Basically, what I want is to um, not only cut trees down to fall, but also chop them with the front and the rear saw blade. Okay, controllers. I need at least two controllers. One here and one here. Okay, now wheels, suspension, simple, no hydraulics, no fancy stuff. I just want four wheels, suspension, off-road suspension, and that's it. I will need more than <laughs> two controllers, more like four or four more. Yeah, no collision. Please, no collision wheels, okay? Can you do that for me? Simplicity equals less or no frames drop. So, how do you like that? Pipes, thick pipes this time. A metal cabin and engine section. I don't know about white color. Uh, but I have not enough um, paint ammo to, to, you know, to experiment. Um, now it's time to connect everything. I've already started to do that, but I will need more controllers, which means I have to farm metal and circuit boards 
and then I'm gonna craft more controllers, upgrade them, and connect everything, connect everything, and we are going to test it. It's a one way to show that I've crafted dress bot. So hours passed, just like in every episode where I build something. I farmed what I had to farm. I crafted what I needed. The truck, cleaner truck, right, is ready downstairs. Now I'm just waiting for the morning. So we got like better view of the truck because it's dark, obviously. And because I got plenty of uh, garment boxes. So let's open some. Nice shoes. Seriously. Work it, work it. Team Blueberry. <laughs> I want this. No, 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 no. Let's, let's. Oh, yes. I have some mods, cosmetic mods installed. We'll talk about the mods in the next episode. But since you can see that I have Fox's Garments mod installed, link in the description below to that mod. And yeah, it's really cool. My mechanic can be a vampire. <laughs> and yeah, new stuff I've unlocked. Team Bloober, yes, this is so cool. Gloves, oh yes. Uh, okay, and shoes. This now I well I need better pants. I would prefer black ones, but yeah. That's I I look badass now. Last one. Lumberjack jacket. Oh, okay, we got wood cleaner truck. Uh, to show so see me <laughs> awesome and it's morning good morning everyone so we got like i said wood cleaner truck to show so let me show you the truck here it is finished as you can see i went with forest colors you could say green and brown i'm sure there is some fantastic name for those shades of green and brown uh, but let's just call them green and brown because this is what it basically is metal cabin wooden base wooden frame i think it looks pretty nice the truck looks just how i wanted just how i imagined really but now frames drop it may or hopefully will not happen let's do it yeah. 58 no frames drop i'm impressed <laughs> But then again the truck is quite light i've noticed that heavy vehicles get frames drop or cause frames drop okay let me show you around first we see a cleaner truck like a saw blade my goodness bit too high from the ground but i didn't want it to scratch the surface when i drive large chest on the side just to pack some i don't know things that i find on the road here we have resource collector which opens or comes out i will show you in a second and i'm sorry and rear saw blade headlights tail lights working like i said resource collector comes out like this because otherwise it would be hitting the saw blade and now we can gather all this stuff laying around all the logs and uh, bots, metal arms and even uh, stone pieces and metal pieces from the stone nodes, right? Now front saw blades have extra mode to chop down fallen trees. And again, I can already see it's too high. So we'll see, we'll test it in a second. Rear saw blade is going down to... Excuse me. 
So once again, rear saw blade goes down. Now let's check the... That was close. Let's check the truck in action. First, let's take the truck for a spin. It feels light, lighter than I thought. But it handles very well. It's enjoyable to drive it. I can feel the weight, the heaviness of the resource collector on the back. So I'm thinking of doubling the rear wheels, make four on the back, four wheels. Overall, it's very dynamic. It reminds me of Hot Rod, you know? It's just as dynamic. Okay, let's find a tree to cut down. This one. Yes, why not? Okay, so let's cut it down first. Closer view. And it's down. Resource collector out. Mm, chopping mode. Front saw blades. Uh oh. See? Front saw blades are too. Yeah, too high. Weird, but yeah. And we go. Again, front saw blades cannot cut this piece here. So, rear saw blade. We need your help. Okay. And let's do it slowly, but surely. Yes, it's out. Too fast, too fast. Slow down, damn it. There we go. Don't run. Okay. Now this piece. Front row front saw blades cannot. Come on, yo. Okay, I got it. Let's cut thinner tree now. Um, oh, I see one over there. Can you? Yeah, you can. Okay, this is okay. Now put it down. Uh, front saw blades chopping mode. Collector out. Rear saw blade down. Let's check it. Yeah, just how I thought. Front saw blades need to... Uh, I, I want to control it, but they have to be r lower. But not like all the time. My goodness. Okay, okay, let's go. So rear saw blade, have to handle it slowly. Yeah, it's very, very difficult to aim when the tree is so thin. Let's try this point of view. Okay, got it. So, some modifications have to be done. First of all, we are going to make the front saw blades lower. But they will be lowering when I want them to be lower. Rear saw blade has to be able to move on the sides. Let's go back to the base. 
Not yet, not yet. <laughs> wait, wait. Faster. And modify the car, the truck. Overall, it works great. I like it very much. I like it just as I like Hot Rod. But it can be better. So if it can be better, let's make it better. All right, let's modify the truck. First, front saw blades. Let's remove them. Simple change, we'll need pipe corners and the bearings. Bearing here, bearing here, um, pipe here and pipe corner here and bearing bearing i'm on the way attach and weld here and it's done oh and paint job done now rear saw blade will be more tricky to modify. First, let's remove it. Yes, we'll need two controllers, two buttons, one more button. Now what we do is pipe corner bearing uh, oh my goodness um sh come on short pipe another bearing how can i even yes now pipe corner like this um, piston pipe short pipe bearing nope sorry another short pipe now bearing and saw blade Okay, of course, paint job. Engine section, we must remove two switches to put two controllers. One here, and this will be moving the rear saw blade to the right side, and this one We'll be moving the rear saw blade to the left. Buttons, I guess here. Switches, one here, one here. This one's for the engine. This one, headlights and taillights, on and off. And we connect everything and then controllers configuration and then we'll see how and if it works so now when i want the resource collector to come out rear saw blade will be going to the front a bit yes works perfectly and then We'll be going like this great okay this we have done okay going down perfect very nice okay keep it down now <laughs> rear saw blade to the left this is maybe a little too close. I wouldn't want to damage the truck and it's a bit too slow. So let's upgrade the controller so we can speed up the movement.
Let's see now. Okay, it's still a bit too slow, but I'm out of component kits, so... Yeah, but it works, basically. In case... And... Resource collector. Okay, now front uh, saw blades. Let's configure. Hmm. I think this should be okay. Right? Right. Okay, so I think we've got it. Field test and official presentation of the wood cleaner truck tomorrow. In game tomorrow. How dare you? I found something. I found stone node, which can be crushed by RCV, aka rock crusher vehicle. So many enemies here, hostile area. But this node is mine. And I want it. But my RCV cannot reach this area because of the trees around. Let's say there is more, right? Right? So, I'm gonna use my wood cleaner truck to clear out the way for RCV. Let's do it. No trees allowed. Front saw blades, chopping mode. Works good now. I think I have to adjust rear saw blade yeah now it should be good and we continue i don't even have to use rear saw blade i mean i have to oh yeah yeah i have to never mind to the right see it's working but i'm just clumsy now front Yo, I'm actually... This is really cool. It actually works very smooth. And rear. Side. Side. Cleared. Handbrake would be nice in Scrap Mechanic. Like, seriously. But, yeah, it works very well. Let's chop smaller, thinner tree. Like this one here. Yeah, yeah. Don't... Okay. Roll down. Chopping. Chopping mode. Now the rear, it's super heavy, the truck. Go down, all right. And let's see, let me turn the car. Yes, thin trees are no problem now. It's all collected. Yeah, it works great. I'm so happy. This is 100% successful build. Wood cleaner truck. I forgot to add wheels to the back. Two more. I don't know about that. I, I mean, collision, lag, you know. So I don't know. But the truck is a success. Okay, let's go back to the base. In the next episode, planned and promised scout aircraft and exploration to find oil pools and trapped farmers. 
also I'm gonna tell you about mods I'm using to make the game more fun but still balanced and once again I'm really really happy this is 100% successful build and the truck is just how I imagined it tons of fun building this thank you very much for watching thank you very much for all the subscriptions and thumbs up See you in the next episode or in other videos on the channel. And that would be it for now. Bye.